Hello, my St. Paul's friends. This is Todd Bosper. Our readings for May 7th are going to be from Romans 1, verses 16 to 17, and Romans 3, verses 22 to 31. I'll be reading from the New Revised Standard Version. For I am not ashamed of the gospel. It is God's saving power for everyone who believes, for the Jew first and also for the Greek. For in it, the righteousness of God is revealed through faith for faith. As it is written, the one who is righteous will live by faith. The righteousness of God through the faith of Jesus Christ for all who believe. For there is no distinction since all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God. They are now justified by his grace as a gift through the redemption that is in Christ Jesus whom God put forward as a sacrifice of atonement by his blood, effective through faith. He did this to demonstrate his righteousness because in his divine forbearance, he had passed over the sins previously committed. It was to demonstrate at the present time his own righteousness so that he is righteous and he justifies the one who has the faith of Jesus. Then what becomes of boasting? it is excluded. Through what kind of law? That of works? No, rather through the law of faith. For we hold that a person is justified by faith apart from works prescribed by the law. For is God the God of Jews only? Is he not the God of Gentiles also? Yes, of Gentiles also. Since God is one, and he will justify the circumcised on the ground of faith and the uncircumcised through that same faith. Do we then overthrow the law through this faith? By no means. On the contrary, we uphold the law.